Good morning, guys. It is currently 6.10 in the morning. I know it's kind of early. You're probably like, why are you up? But today I'm doing a day in my life, and I go to school today. I go to school Tuesdays and Thursdays, so I get all my classes done within two days of the week, which I really am excited about because I only have to go to school two days a week. Who doesn't love that? I think I'm going to go to Starbucks because I'm really hungry and no food in my house. So I'm going to do that, and I want to show you my outfit really quickly first. Yes, I am vlogging with my phone because... I don't have a vlog camera, but I am wearing this tie-up t-shirt dress from Forever 21, a denim jacket from Forever 21, these two necklaces from my boyfriend Jack, and then these bracelets that support Jack and his cancer, and then this bracelet I got me and Jack matching for anniversary. So today I'm just going to take you around with me in my normal college everyday life, and I hope you enjoy. It's my first time doing one of these videos, and I love watching these types of videos myself, so I hope you enjoy. Yeah, I'm using a light. I finally got one of those, so I'm excited. Um, right now, I have to go get my food and put it in my backpack, so let's go. You can't even barely see me because it's so dark outside. This is how early I leave, like, where's the sun? I am at Starbucks. I just got a strawberry green tea infused lemonade. I've never gotten it before, so that'll be interesting. And I got a everything bagel, mini bagel, and then a plain mini bagel. They're really good. I recommend getting them. We're gonna try the strawberry green tea infused lemonade. I'm really nervous. It's pretty good. It's like not that sweet. I like it. This might be my new favorite drink. So it normally takes me about an hour, hour and a half to get to school sometimes depending on traffic. But I mean, I hope I get to school on time. Usually I get to school like 30 minutes early and then I sleep in my car. So maybe I'll do that today. I don't know. I'm really tired. <laughs> okay, let's go to school. Every time you leave me, the quick of these tears dry. And every time you walk out, the less I love you. This is my song! Baby, we don't stand a chance. It's sad that yeah, it's that's true. Fantastic. I'm way too good at goodbye. He just interrupted Sam Smith. You do not do that. You know when like you love something so much, you just keep drinking it? Like, I'm sad that this is going to be gone by the time I get to school. That should not happen. I need to stop drinking this. Like, I know that this is a weird angle. I just don't have like a car tripod and this guy just cut me off. I know I don't have a car tripod. That's why this angle is kind of weird, but I mean it works. You know, I'm just kind of resting on my car ledge. We're chilling. Okay guys, update time. It is currently 8 o'clock now. I got to school at like 7.20, 7.25, and I've just been in the car finishing some English homework and updating my planner because I gotta catch up on that. I have been so bad at writing my planner, but I was just updating like my work schedule and my classes and my homework that's due. I'm gonna go to class now, so y'all. I'm just gonna show you what the life of a college student looks like in the back of my car really like my car is just so messy now like it never used to be this messy now it's just messy all the time okay let's go to class to begin my day i always take the stairs even throughout the day i take the stairs just because i feel like i get way more exercise in even though it's just walking i feel like it still helps me My first class is English 101 and it is in Langsford Hall. I get here kind of early just because I don't like sitting in my car for 30 minutes. I like to be in class and just feel ready and prepared for the day. In this class I like to use a blue and a green pen and this just keeps my notes organized. So I have the green for the main topics and then the blue for all the details that go along with it. And today we were just learning about analytical essays because we have to write one soon. My next class is in the visual arts area, but it's not a visual arts class, it's actually psychology. We learned about social development and children. For this class, I use a purple and pink pen for the same reason as my English class.
All right guys, so I just had a meeting with one of my mentors for one of my classes and now I get to go to lunch and have lunch with my friend Maddie. We're having like a party. I don't know if it's like a party. I don't know what's going on here today. I forgot what it's called. It's called ASI All Day. We have like stuff going on during the day and then at night there's like concerts and stuff. And yeah, I don't really know what it is. Oh no, are you vlogging? from here down. Thank you, Maddie. <laughs> okay, so. Oh my god, you're talking <laughs> out loud though? Yeah. Okay, talk <laughs> See, now you understand me. Me and Maddie ended up in Mahalo oh. Hall. We always end up here for some reason. I'm a business major. Yeah, she's a business it's major. Part of my business. Look at this light. Fix Ooh. my light. <laughs> JK can't do that in one second. True. Now gas is going to increase by 15 cents. Sorry. In California. You're welcome if you're not there. So get gas now. Don't transport a fridge on its side. It has to be standing upright. Don't sit in your car with the radio on. That wastes your battery. Don't sit in the car with the car running. Waste your gas. Gas is too expensive. What was the other one? Blood. What? The blood one. Oh. With the aspirin. For ladies. Don't take aspirin on your period. Aspirin's a blood thinner. On your period. I'm talking about this very loud. For public. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> that was some wise knowledge from Maddie. Thank you, Maddie. Hi, you, my parents are real. I just left the parking structure because I had to get two notebooks for my two last classes. Now I'm headed to the lava lounge to meet up with some more friends. Maddie left me because she had to go to class, but that's okay. The lava lounge is a place for like undeclared students to hang out in and just study and stuff. So this is where I go every day after Maddie leaves me. I feel like I've never said this. So for those of you who don't know, I go to Cal State Fullerton. It's pretty exciting. Yep. Sarah, you're finally here. <laughs> We're already leaving. Say hello. <laughs> what the hell is going Why? on? Hurry, do the new one. No, don't watch it. Do, do watch it. <laughs> Let's, Let's not and say we did. <laughs> Quick, this pixel they just said, class is canceled. Oh my god, class is canceled. <laughs> class got canceled. What? <laughs> Well, yeah. You know. Oh, I have another class. So. Well, well, I don't have another sorry. class, but we have another, another class. reason. Yeah. Bye, YouTube. Bye, YouTube. Thank you. Okay. Let's go. Bye, YouTube. <laughs> After lunch, I I had my art class, which we learned about architecture today, and I use a purple and blue pen for this class. So today's been a good day. I didn't have that one class I was supposed to go to, which I made so happy because that class is literally nothing. And I got out of my art class early, which means I get to go home early. So let's go home. Let's go home. I'm really tired. Today has been a long day. And I don't have classes until Tuesday. But I have a work Friday, Saturday, Sunday, Monday. So, gotta get my rest. I'm just gonna up you, update you guys on how I'm feeling right now. I'm kind of a, not upset. I'm just a little bit bummed because I haven't seen my boyfriend Jack in a while. I was really hoping to see him today, but I'm not going to. Maybe Saturday, hopefully. I'm just kind of sad. Because I don't know, I'm like PMS and stuff. I know TMI, but I miss him a lot and I haven't seen him in a while. So I'm just kind of sad about that. So it's kind of feeling bleh. But I think when I get home, I'm gonna go to dinner with my mom, which I'm happy about because I like spending time with my mother and just bonding with her and stuff. So that should be fun and I'm hungry, so even better. I'm just gonna talk a little bit to you guys about my day. Sorry if this lighting is weird. There's like tree and sun and stuff, but. So today I talked to one of my mentors from one of my classes and basically she just like asked me how I'm doing and we had to take this test online before school started about like our life and how we manage and how we study and stuff. Basically we went, we went over those results and my lowest point is stress. So basically, it's telling me that I don't know how to um, 
self manage my stress and that I get really overly stressed and we talked about how I basically work two jobs because of YouTube and then TJ Maxx and then how my boyfriend's in the hospital and how I have school so I really have no time for myself and to like be stress free I know I I'm young and I don't need to be stressed out but I mean college is stressful and then having two jobs and everything you know it's just a lot and I we basically come to the realization where I need to make time for myself because I'm not doing that and like I didn't even have time for myself like I was just telling my parents how I feel like I haven't been home in like weeks I feel like I have been out of the house doing so many things and it's not like I mean I'm, I choose to be out of the house because of school and work but it's like not fun for me besides like going to visit Jack. So basically I just wanted to say like thank you for giving me this platform to express myself and I hope that you guys if you're stressing like me just try to take time for yourself because if you don't it's all going to be built up like stress that you are constantly having and that's not good because I know I feel like I cry almost every night because I'm so stressed and like that might sound like needy or like that I'm just a crybaby and I'm being stupid but no it's like I'm so stressed I don't know what to do with myself. I hope that if you guys feel the same way you can find a time and space to like relieve yourself of that stress because I really need to do that and like taking baths and showers sometimes help me like I just sit and I listen to music and I like take in everything that's happening so yeah thanks for listening i don't know why i just want to talk about that <laughs> at dinner with my mother oh thank you mom say hello how exciting we got miso soup chicken teriyaki crunchy roll steamed rice and a salad and my mom got her food update so it has been a while since i've been home you can't tell I'm really tired. I've been editing this vlog for almost an hour now, like over an hour. <laughs> and I've been watching Keeping Up with the Kardashians. I've been snacking on some sugar-free chocolate that I've been eating. And I don't know, I'm just really tired. So I decided to end the vlog. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up and leave a comment down below if you'd like to see any other vlogs or like another college day in my life i know that this is like the first video like this i'm filming and i don't know if i'll keep doing it i'll keep doing it if you guys like it but i know that the quality isn't the best i don't have like a vlogging camera and i don't really plan on buying one i just vlog with my phone because i feel like it's good enough for a vlog it doesn't need to be fancy and it's just more casual this way so if you guys agree please give it a thumbs up and always leave a comment down below tell me what you think and i hope you guys have an amazing day don't forget to subscribe i'll see you guys next week bye guys